Now, WGEM Sports with Sports Director Tony Cornish Jr. The Quincy High Boys track and field team will be headed south to Collinsville on Saturday. That's good news. That's where the blue and white will take part in the highly competitive Collinsville Invitational. And they're, wait, they're waiting for that competition. The Quincy High practice sessions this week have been very loose and quite focused, though, on they focus on the job at hand, and when the blue and white hit that track tomorrow at CHHS, I tell you what, uh, the top teams from across the region will be waiting there to compete as well. QHS head track and field coach Laura McClellan took time out from drills yesterday to offer us a quick preview regarding some of the top Blue Devils we need to watch out for in the next 24 hours in Collinsville. So as usual, we'll um, see our top distance guys, Eric McClellan, Tommy Hess, um, they should have some really good competition down there. Bowen Brockmiller, um, as long as we can get him healthy, he's sick. Seems to be something going around the school right now. But he um, should be running a uh, 1 2 4. Uh, Garrett Coleman, um, so Riley Lissy in the 100, 110 hurdles and the 300 hurdles. Really big competition, and since we're in the Edwardsville uh, sectional, actually. We're getting a look at our competition four sectionals in a few weeks. Track is just a mental sport to begin with, and you just got to make sure you're mentally there and prepared for everything you got to do. Track is just a mental sport. I've got to write that down and remember it. I like that.